You go to the gym and do the most awesome, bestest workout possible, meal prep all your bland broccoli and chicken breasts, and take all the overpriced supplements you found on a fitness Instagram, yet even though you seem to be doing everything right, your buddy who started getting in shape about the same time as you is still getting better results. And he or she does the same workouts but hardly meal preps while eating the occasional pizza and ice cream. And the only supplement he's taken is the protein shake he found on sale in the bargain bin. So how is this possible? Well, what you didn't realize is that your friend is doing better at the number one most important thing outside of exercising than you are. While you're binge watching on the new hot TV series, or playing your favorite video game for hours, or even just staying up doing whatever you might be doing on the internet, your buddy is hard at work sleeping. If you're the nocturnal type that gets hardly any sleep with the occasional 8 hour sleep, chances are you're holding yourself back from getting the best results possible. We already know how important sleep is just for the sake of survival, after all, all animals have to sleep sometime. When it comes to increasing your gains, sleeping is pretty darn important. Let's start off with the most obvious effect of not sleeping enough, and that's the negative impact on performance. If you ever go to the gym feeling tired and sleepy, chances are you won't be doing half as much work as you normally would. Studies on sleep found that subjects chronically lacking sleep had significantly slower reaction times on the psychomotor vigilance tests. Slower alertness means both lower mental and motor capacity. Plus, studies found sleep deprivation increases the amount of mistakes people make, leading to a possible increase in injuries. And we all know if you're hurt, you ain't working out to begin with. As far as actual performance, sleep deprivation doesn't really affect your peak capabilities, meaning you still can push heavy weights or perform at a high intensity, but you'll get tired quicker. Researchers believe this is because when sleep deprived, people tend to have trouble metabolizing glucose. Since glucose is important for energy, not being able to break glucose down means your energy levels will be breaking down instead. Outside of performance, sleep plays the ever crucial role of balancing hormones. When we sleep, your body releases high amounts of anabolic hormones such as testosterone and IGF-1. You've probably heard of testosterone before and its close relationship with building muscle. When sleep is disrupted, however, especially when disrupting the first cycle of REM sleep, the release of these ever important hormones take much longer. This can disrupt the body's ability to repair and build muscle during sleep, and even worse, a study found that subjects suffering from sleep apnea have at lower levels of overall testosterone, a combination that for sure will reduce your gains. And the effect on hormones doesn't stop there. One thing that sleep is also good for is bringing down the levels of muscle breaking hormones, aka catabolism. Cortisol, the main culprit of these hormones, remain elevated whenever you don't get a good night's rest. And the tricky thing about this is that the time you sleep matters too. Even if you're getting proper amount of sleep, studies have found that people sleeping in the daytime were not able to bring down cortisol levels as much as people sleeping regular hours of the night. This is because there is a connection between cortisol secretion and the natural clock in which your body operates on known as the circadian rhythm. You night owls might be losing more muscle mass than your early sleeping counterparts because your cortisol levels are shot. And even if you're not shooting for gains but let's say you're trying to lose weight instead, sleeping doesn't necessarily help you lose more weight but it does help you lose the right type of weight. When compared to people that slept 5.5 hours per night, people that slept 8 hours per night lost the same amount of weight but they lost 55% more fat while preserving 60% more muscle. It's almost like you're sleeping your fat away. Not to forget that multitude of studies have shown lack of sleep, increased levels of the appetite raising hormone, growth while decreasing leptin, the hormone responsible for making you feel full. So less sleep can equal to more eating and a bigger belly. So moral of the story is, don't mess with your sleep. Get your sleep and get enough of it. Heck, if you're watching this right now at 1 in the morning, turn off your phone, your computer, whatever. Don't even bother liking, sharing, nor subscribing. Just go to sleep. Now, let your dreams be dreams. Good night.